violence and tonight dozens of families got some food and a message inside Birmingham's Kingston community. It's all part of an effort by community leaders to bring a ceasefire to the neighborhood. Our Josh Gann is on your side tonight. He was at that event and Josh, you have more on why a church there is now stepping up to try and put an end to this violence. Yeah, that's right. Lighthouse Ministries trying to be a beacon of hope in a community often plagued with violence. They're asking people to put down the weapons and call a truce. No more fighting. We declare the decree that it must cease right now. A prayer for peace. Then pounding the pavement with a purpose. Lighthouse Church Ministries calling for a ceasefire in the Kingston community. Several church members going door to door, handing out food and praying with residents, and giving them these cards with a message saying there's a better way to deal with conflict, like not arguing, walking away, and praying. We believe if they do all three of those steps, they will live to see another day. We're believing that they will partner with us so that we can, you know, cause the crime here to just die down. The historic church located in the heart of Kingston, trying to reach the youth and their families to give them hope. I think a big problem is sometimes people are too afraid to get out into the community, too afraid to get out and talk to these people. And what we're trying to let them know is, hey, we love y'all. We're here. We want to make our church the hub. We want to get resources here to be able to help everybody in the community. We're told the church building was used during the Civil Rights Movement as a place for organizing. That's the hope once again today for this place of refuge. Just like the Civil Rights Movement, we want to be able to stop things that are not going well within the community and make a positive change. Now the church fed about 50 families today. They are also in the process of putting together summer and after school programs to keep kids safe and busy. Live in Birmingham tonight, I'm Josh Gant, WBRC, Fox 6 News on your side.